Dr. Scott Wooder. I'm the president of the Ontario Medical Association. And I'd like to talk to you today about cycling safety. There's a few very simple things you can do to stay safe while you cycle, especially when there are cars and pedestrians around. So let's get started. First, make sure that your bike is in good shape and ready to ride. You should make sure you have air in your tires, working brakes, front lights, and a backlight or reflector, and a working bell. Finally, you should wear a helmet to protect yourself in case you fall. When you're riding, stay as far to the right as it's safe for you to do. If there are potholes and grates, move out of the way a little to make sure you won't be knocked off your bike. If you're riding by parked cars, watch out for people getting out of the driver's side. Leave enough room to allow you to react quickly to unexpected actions. It's important that everyone obey the traffic signals. Besides being the law, stopping at red lights or stop signs to let pedestrians cross is the polite and safe thing to do. Avoid riding your bike across a cross section with pedestrians. Since you're moving faster than the pedestrians, you run the risk of hurting someone, and there's a chance you will get hit by a car whose driver can't see you in time to stop. When driving, make sure you check your blind spot before turning right, as there may be cyclists riding right beside you. Know your hand signals. Raise your hand for a right hand signal. Hold your arm straight out for a left hand signal and lower your arm with the palm facing behind you to signal you're stopping. This will also indicate to cars that you want to turn, change lanes, or stop. It's important that we all share the road safely. Whether you're riding or driving, be patient, be courteous, and obey all the traffic rules. Take a few minutes extra to get to your destination. Remember, every cyclist is somebody's son or daughter, mother or father. Take a few extra minutes, save a life. 